What's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today's vlog is going to be just a vlog. So right now, Mitch is cooking dinner and I am about to paint this table. Um, I actually had started talking about this a couple of weeks ago, maybe last week. And then we actually went to Home Depot and the paint was like double the price. So we ordered it on Amazon. And so now we finally have gotten the paint. We're getting around to painting a table. We've been flipping furniture, which is just like a fun hobby of ours and a fun way to make extra money. Sorry, I'm getting my tripod ready to put you on because I've got my little setup over here. So this is the table and um, it is this really nice, like dark wooden table. I think that it would look so much better painted white. The style here in Cleveland ooh, is very like farmhousey is what a lot of people like. So I'm gonna paint it white and I feel like it'll look more farmhousey. I got some chalk paint which I'm gonna open in a second and I'll show you and then we'll just do like a little time lapse of this project. This is the paint we bought. It is linen white Rust-Oleum chalk paint. We got it on Amazon, I'll link it below, it was only $10. We got two of them, so I don't know how much paint that this ta table's gonna take, so we'll see, let's get started. So here's the first coat on the top. Um, yeah, I don't really have much to say. The, our brush sucks and I didn't really realize it until I started painting this. Um, but I think that it's actually gonna come out looking really good. You can't really tell, I don't think, in the time lapse. So I'll just do little updates like this. So right now I'm gonna work on painting around the table, um, doing the first coat around the table. Okay, so here's an update. The table actually is looking really good. It's just really hard to get into the space, so you have to do like a, just like the small sections at a time. So this is gonna be a work in progress probably over the course of tomorrow, so I'll continue to update. Um, but it's looking good so far. Um, also, we are actually headed out to try this new place in Pinecrest, which is not far from where we live right now and it is a restaurant and bar and it's called the last page and they look like they have really cool drinks so we're gonna go get a drink um from there and i was going to show my outfit this is disgusting in here so i don't want you seeing our disgusting food it needs to be cleaned up okay i'm wearing this black blazer that I thrifted from Goodwill in Nashville. This is a tank top, crop top from, I honestly don't even know, I've had this forever. And then Levi jeans, and then I have these heels on. So I'm gonna take a pic. I'm not wearing any makeup. I put on some mascara and some brow gel, but my face is breaking out right now, and so I just really don't feel like makeup on today because I was filming stuff, and I just really don't feel like putting on makeup, so. We're not gonna. 
All right, so we're sitting in like this outdoor, kind of like half outdoor area. You can see like there, there's like an outdoor patio and the bar is right there and the dining is in there. So we got our menu. Oh, it's like a, it's almost like fabric. Yeah. Interesting. So we're gonna pick out our drinks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so they just poured out a bitch drink and I had all this smoke while insert video of it kind of like quickly grabbed it on my phone. But our drinks are so good. I got the botanics and Mitch got the last minute hand. And they are amazing. This whole place is like such a vibe. It's so cool. Isn't it? It's like a vibey place. It is a vibey place. Um, my cocktail has a little flower in it, which is so cute. My ice cube. And then there's his. And it's not focusing, but whatever. Oh, yeah, whatever. All right, we just left. And 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. So, seriously, it was so good. The drinks were amazing. The atmosphere was awesome. Service is great. Yeah. So 10 out of 10. The food looks really good too. Um, we didn't get food because we just came for drinks, but we definitely will go back and uh, try some of their food. Totally. Highly recommend. I'll have their them linked below in the description in case you want to go check it out. But yeah, definitely be going back. The smoke is like the coolest part because <laughs> you can like buy those things and have yeah. them at home like smoke your own drinks but that was cool because they like brought it to your table which I feel like they normally don't do they normally just like smoke it in the back and then you know leave it yeah that's true they normally don't bring it out and like every single drink looks so so good I had actually had a hard time choosing my drink which typically is not the case yeah normally I just want one but there's a lot yeah yeah so it's cool and it's weird leaving when it's light out we're at 8 30. I know it's strange. <laughs> We're gonna go home and chill. So I'll probably pick up the vlog tomorrow. Bye. All right, we went to the 27 Club, which is downtown Cleveland, and they got vegan cinnamon rolls. I never get to eat cinnamon rolls. These things took <laughs> 74 minutes to bake. Look at that. Oh, they have multiple. Look at that. Those look good. Yeah, yeah. Look, they're pink. They're pink. Oh, yeah. Very on brand. Sauce. MGK loves his pink. We got Americanos. Now we're sitting by the water. And they're eating their breakfast. lighting right so it's raining outside so it's super dark here in the apartment but I wanted to do a little haul it's literally three pieces well, actually four because I got some clips that I'll show you from Amazon but um, a little thrift haul so I've seen these like green shirts on everyone Zara is sold out of them and so I went to the thrift store specifically looking for colored shirts and I wanted a blue one and I wanted a green one and I'll post some of my inspiration on the screen for the green right here and then once I try on the blue I will post some inspiration for the blue but this was like eight dollars it's a really nice quality um I didn't want to go get like a cheap one from Walmart and pay like 12 bucks for it because I knew I could find a good quality one at the thrift store um let me try and lower my camera okay so I obviously have sweatpants on but you can see the length it'd be perfect to wear with some you can button it up and wear jean shorts and heels I could have it open up and wear kind of like a bandeau type thing that I'm wearing now with some high-waisted shorts uh, or jeans I could wear this as a pool cover-up it's just a really cute fun summery color so if you're looking for something like this check out Goodwill and then I'll try on the blue one next 
Okay, so here's the blue. This is a men's medium. I think the other one was a men's medium. Yeah, so here's the tag. And then this blue one is actually like the Goodfella brand from Target, and this was only $4. Uh, it's in perfect condition. It's like it was never worn. And um, I'll post the inspiration on the screen here, but it's just really pretty blue color. And again, I could wear it same ways as the green. And I just had a vision for wearing this with like some long jeans and some tennis shoes or sandals or something. So there's this one. And then I have one more thing. And then I have this sweater, which is a wool sweater from Ireland. I actually love to collect like uh, white sweaters from thrift stores. And so I saw this one and I loved the pattern on it. I loved the buttons. I loved the shape. Um, and so I decided to just pick this up while I was there. I think I got this for seven or eight dollars. Um, so yeah. And then let's bring the camera back up. Oh geez, this lighting is just terrible. But I'm gonna grab, I ordered some like hair clips on Amazon and I'm gonna grab those. So I got this pack of four hair clips for like three bucks on Amazon. And they have this really cool like matte finish to them. And I wanted some fun colors, so I really liked the blue. And then the pink is obviously always fun. I feel like the pink paired with this green uh, shirt would look really, really cute. Um, and then there's a black one, which you can always use a black clip. And then there's this really pretty green color too. So I'll have these linked below. I just have one claw clip, so I was looking for more and found these on Amazon. They were a great price. So I'll have these linked below. Um, I'll try and find some similar shirts to the Goodwill ones. I'm not gonna find a similar sweater because it's not winter, so I'm not even gonna waste my time because I'm assuming no one's shopping for sweaters. But I just wanted to do a quick little thrift haul before I ended the vlog. So thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and like this video. And I will see you in the next video.